with Christmas celebrations upon us and 2019 coming to a close, now is a good time to look back on what has been yet another unforgettable year for the GFG Alliance. 2019 has been a year of growth and transformation, perhaps GFG's most profound year to date. It hasn't been without its challenges. This year, we navigated the worst market conditions seen for over a decade in our industry. But now, finally, as the year comes to an end, the market is in strong recovery and showing further promise. These headwinds in 2019 motivated us to make changes and accelerate our quest to green steel, a more viable model, both economically and environmentally. In our boldest step so far, in July, we accomplished the acquisition of seven major steelworks in Europe. This more than doubled our workforce globally. This growth also provided the platform to consolidate all the steel and related assets into a single global entity and the launch of the Liberty Steel Group, making it the eighth largest in the world outside China with over 18 million tons of steel products capacity. Its formation will enable greater transparency and allow us to communicate better with our stakeholders, also providing for increased governance and other benefits through economies of scale. Our management team continues to grow and take shape as we welcome new global leaders into our family this year. They will help us challenge mindsets, driving ongoing change and growth across our businesses. This consolidation also provides the opportunity to present a united, vibrant, profitable and growing steel group with a solid purpose through CN30. Through our task force CN30, we will lead the industry to a carbon neutral future by using our Green Street strategy, which focuses on renewable energy and electric arc furnaces to recycle steel scrap. In 2019, we saw renewable energy become much more mainstream and we want solid endorsement of our renewable initiatives launched over the last few years. In the new year, we will continue in this stead, launching further revolutionary projects made possible by access to competitive renewable energy, such as hydrogen and its application to green steel. Through our CN30 mission, we are calling out a new ecological revolution, which will be no less than the industrial or digital revolutions of the last century. For GFG, this evolution is about balance and transition. We will transform plants to a carbon neutral future. We will be brave and we will be swift, but also measured and balanced. We have continued to live our values of change, family and sustainability throughout the businesses and geographies we operate in. In Australia, we saw the launch of Infobuilt as a market leading construction and building solutions partner and the successful launch of our first public bond, despite significant headwinds. Infrabuild has started a great journey of transparency, continuous improvement and growth. The rest of our group will follow in these footsteps. The Wyala transformation is now finally underway, with construction planned to start in the new year of our groundbreaking state-of-the-art rail and sections mill, supplied by Danieli of Italy, and of Kultana, Australia's largest solar farm. In the UK, the Brexit turmoil saw a rapid decline of UK industry, which was already under pressure. From this low point, we end the year with a strong new government with a mandate to rebuild our industry. We look forward to a new era of investment and growth for our industry in the UK. In Europe, after completing the acquisition of the seven steel plants, the last few months have been about integration and stabilization and the formulation of significant new investment plans to realize the potential of these plants, taking them once again to a leadership position in their respective markets. Our aluminum business in Europe also got a significant boost this year with the announcement of the Duffel acquisition expected to close in the new year. A world leading aluminum sheet business, renowned for its prowess, supplying the high end auto market and other sectors. United States also saw a very volatile year in the steel market with a sharp downfall in the middle of the year and recovery again as the year came to a close. This period of turmoil motivated us to make significant inroads in transforming our businesses, placing us in a very strong position to take advantage of the recovery in the steel market now well underway. In 2019, we also faced a bumpy start in India. But again, we end the year making significant inroads and I'm confident 
India will become a strong part of GFG's future growth plans. More broadly, operations like the GFG Foundation, Chahama and Violence that we set up in the UK are growing and developing strong roots in other parts of the globe. The GFG Foundation in the UK recently celebrated the achievements of over 100 students at the Geared Up for STEM event in Newport. And in August, we launched the foundation in Australia, welcoming Wireless young people as our first test pilots for the program, with plans to grow this dramatically in the coming year. We also celebrated the launch of our property arm Jahama in Australia, who will be looking for new and innovative solutions to unlock and leverage our assets. Given the momentous year we have had, to welcome all the new members of the GFG family and to say thank you to all our existing family, I have sent a small gift, the flame pin, for every employee within GFG. The flame is a symbol of our family, uniting us in a common quest across all our businesses. I hope that you will wear it with pride, as I do every day. Christmas is a time to give and a time to think of those in need. As I'm sure all of you around the world have been watching in the news, Australia has been ravaged with unprecedented fires across the country, affecting many of our businesses and many of our people in their communities. In response, we're launching a fire health fund in Australia, which will aim to bring help to our local communities that have been impacted. All GFT family are invited to contribute to this fund. I will personally match the funding we're able to raise as a group. We will shortly be setting up a website for this campaign. There is no doubt that 2019 has been a challenging year for many of our businesses, impacted by global factors and headwinds. However, while the road can be bumpy at times, we should take a moment to celebrate the incredible things that we have achieved this year, despite these conditions. We have a powerful and unique mission, vision, and set of guiding values that are designed for the long term. I'm confident that we will transform our industry for the better, securing not only our future, but the future of generations to come. I thank you all for believing in me. From me and from my family, I wish each and every one of you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.